Hello, everybody. I'm here with the amazing psychic Liz Cross. How are you doing this morning? Uh, it's early and I'm still drinking my tea. Yes, it is early as usual. All right. Well, we're here with a listener request. This is volume 11. We try to do one at least every month. And, you know, we apologize if we don't get to everybody's in one video, but, you know, we only have so much brain power between the both of us to do in one sitting. So we'll we'll try our best. If we don't get to it, we'll get you on the next one. Now, our members on our Discord are the ones that are submitting these coins. So if you would like to support the channel and also have your coins probed, you can become a member on our Patreon and then connect that to your Discord. And you will have access to all of our videos. You'll have the second part to this video. You'll have access to my particular group where I share all kinds of information. People are making money in there. We just hit like a 30x on one of our calls, what I called out in the, the Discord. So you really are missing out if you're not in there and have your alerts on and following it like it's the you know it's the it's you need to follow it so if you want to participate in all this and and also support us how do they do that liz you go to patreon.com forward slash remote viewing and beyond it will be in the comments as well as mr photon's email and his tip jar that's right, because I do crypto consults. So if you're a beginner, I can hold your hand. If you're more advanced, I have a lot of alpha for you. Um, and I'm just finding that people that have even been in the game for a few years, they really don't know some basic stuff. And why is that? Because they don't really want to teach you that stuff because it takes away other people's edge in the market. So I can bring you up to speed on everything you should know by this time. And it's really important. So you can get a hold of me at my email at digitalfreedomtactics at protonmail.com. And also, if you appreciate what I do, yeah, you can throw me a few shekels in the tip jar below. Do appreciate that. All righty, let's get into it. So first coin up, um, we've done, I think we might have done this before, but it was requested again. And, you know, we did it a long time ago. Uh, we're going to compare it to Matic this time. I think we compared it to Shiba Inu. So that was the request. So this coin is called Wojak. It's W-O-J-A-K. Can we ask how well this coin does over the next couple of years from where it is now to its ultimate price peak compared to Matic in the last bull run of 2021 on a scale of 1 to 10? On the 10 and, project, in the last bull run. We're also, obviously asking my master team forgot to, to acknowledge them. Yeah, they're here. They're, okay. They've been up all night. And the moon uh, also. <laughs> <laughs> Moon is there, going for those of you that are new, this, this master team, they like to party in my room all night. Um, All right. Uh, well, Jack, on a scale of 1 to 10 from where it is now to its ultimate price peak, compared to Matic in the last bull run 2021, how does the score? Scores a 7. Okay. So from where it is now, that's a, like a 10x or more. I don't think it's quite a 10x. Okay. So maybe a, between a 5, something like a 5x or something. Yes. Okay. All right. Next up, we have uh, Ponke. Oops, sorry, this is in the way. There we go. Okay. Ponke, P O N K E. Can we ask how well Ponke does over the next couple of years compared to Matic in the last bull run of 2021 on a scale of 1 to 10 from where it is now to its ultimate price peak over the next couple of years? Over the, um, from where it is now to its ultimate price peak over the next couple of years compared to Matic in the last bull run, 2021 on a scale of 1 to 10. That's a four. Okay, next up we have Bonk. Can we ask how well Bonk does, B-O-N-K, over the next couple of years compared to Matic in the last bull run of 2021 on a scale of 1 to 10 from where it is now to its ultimate price peak over the next couple of years? This uh, is not the only Bonk. Correct. I think, yeah, there's a bunch of them. So let's bring up. The oh, OK. Address. So I'm going to take the contract address and paste it up here at the top for you. So it ends in B263. B263, compared to Matic in the last bull run. It's still among the 10. Um, from where it is now to its ultimate price peak. Okay, that's about a six. Okay, all right. Why is this one different from all the other ones? Uh, this was the first one. This is the first one? Yeah. Oh, okay. 
Uh, next up is dog with hat. Um, and there may be, at this point, there's probably a few of these now. So let's do the same thing. I'm going to get the contract address for you here. It ends in ZCJM. Can we ask how well dog with hat does over the next couple of years compared to Matic in the last bull run of 2021 on a scale of one to 10 from where it is now to its ultimate price peak over the next couple of years? From where it is now, that's ultimate price peak over the next couple of years compared to Matic in the last well run. How well does dog with hat do? No, that's a three. Okay. Yeah, it's already, I mean, it's it's already a $1.3 billion market cap. It's, uh, yeah, okay. Interesting that it scores a three, huh? All right. So we're going to switch over to deck screener here. So we the next one is a political coin. Someone has rec uh, requested. It's called Kamala. It's on Ethereum. Can we ask how well Kamala does on Ethereum from where it is now to its ultimate price peak over the next couple of years on a scale of 1 to 10 compared to Matic? On a scale of 1 to 10 compared to Matic from where it is now to its ultimate price peak, how well does... Kamala to over the next five years. And it's boring. Hmm. It's going to have one more run and then it's done. Okay. Too risky. All right. Too risky. All right. Uh, and like, what is that on a scale of one to 10? This um, next run. It's like a five. Okay, so it's not too crazy. All right. Um, you'll struggle to get out of that coin. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There's not a lot of liquidity in there right now. So. Ah. Okay. Because that's what I got. Like it's gonna. You'll be lucky if you get it, all your money out. <laughs> right. Okay. Uh, last one before we take it over for the members for the second part of this video. This one is called XPRT, Persistence One. Can we ask how well XPRT does over the next couple of years compared to Matic in the last bull run, 2021, from where it is now to its ultimate price peak over the next couple of years? Is this the persistence that was around a long time ago? Yes. Mm. The original one, yes. Okay. Um, persistence one compared to Matic in the last bull run of 2021. How well does it do? Over the next couple of years, from where it is now to its ultimate price peak, how well does it do? It's a four. Okay. All right. So we're going to end this. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Yeah. It's like Theta. It's going yeah. nowhere. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we're going to end this one here, but we will continue on for all the the rest of the, the coins that have been requested that we can get through today. And if you, again, if you want to see the, all the videos that we do, not just the second part of this video, you have to become a Patreon member and support us there. Um, so how do they do that, Liz? So hopefully we'll see you there, patreon.com forward slash remote viewing and beyond. And there are options just to support the channel. You can do that on the Patreon or on YouTube. It's just a couple of bucks. Uh, so thank you so much for all of our subscribers. We really appreciate it. You're the reason we're here. We show up bright and early every day. Uh, these ungodly hours. <laughs> yeah. And uh, we hope to see you there. So thank you. Thank you.